Hey, what's up, everybody? This is going to be a real quick video of my mycomicshop.com order, which came in the day after my uh, my live stream. So I just want to do that real quick. I also got this thing from a Sticker Mule, which apparently they're doing like t-shirts now, custom t-shirts. And they had a special where they did <clears throat> um, $9 for a custom t-shirt. All you got to do is upload the design. And that's, um, I'm really hoping that it, it doesn't look that good because this is going to be a real problem for those of us that um, that make t-shirts on our own. Uh, the Sticker Mule can start making like custom t-shirts for, well, they're probably going to be like 20 bucks for $19.99 or whatever to start. Uh, but if they're going to start doing that, it's going to be really hard for the rest of us who uh, either farm out our t-shirts through um, like these services, um, I think T Fury is one of them, or like me, have a heat press and make our own t shirts. So, uh oh, looks like it's a good shirt, too. This is, I, um, I have an awesome, I had an awesome five t shirt, my one of my comic creations, and it was starting to wear out. Oh my god, it's like an impenetrable bag. So, I figured, okay, I just use this. To one, replace my old Awesome Five t-shirt, and two, see what a sticker meal look, looks like. It looks like, uh, okay, it took a while to come, too. Of course, they got their own um, proprietary, nice, tagless label. Of course, they do. The shirt actually looks pretty good, too. Well, I don't know if it's a Bella canvas. It's 100% uh, cotton. Printed in Amsterdam, New York. Made in America, even. Jeez. Wow, and uh, it looks like it's a really nice shirt. It's it's pretty it's pretty pretty huge logo. It's, it's bigger. It Look kind of crazy. It's not like glittery in person, but um, I guess the uh, the transfer comes off that way on the on the camera. But uh, it's kind of a cool shirt actually. It's, it's nice quality. So. Good news, bad news situation. <laughs> got a nice replacement shirt, but this competition for teachers just got a lot stiffer, everybody. So uh, that's not how you call. That's not why you call. First, that's out of the way. Now we're gonna do the comic unboxing. Now this was um probably maybe two weeks ago when I ordered this. At this point, because everything's running a week behind. Is it a holiday? Um, and I have another one coming probably, maybe it'll be on time now the holidays passed, or about to pass, I should say. So, there's some pretty decent stuff in here, I think, too, so that's why I want to, I want to share, hopefully, hopefully, it'll be a nice bunch of books. My dog, Izzy, is having a conniption because whenever my wife leaves the house, uh, she just, just freaks out. So I got like meditation music playing in the background, and you might hear him whimper. So hope I won't get a strike from YouTube for playing the music. All right. Wow. Okay. This is the one I was one was I was looking forward to here. This is the um, Batman 118, the uh, Virgin cover. This is this is nice. This is nice. So that's right off the bat. I should have a bunch of this issue in here. And next, oh, this is the last book you'll ever read. Number four, uh, the Naughty Cover. The Batman 118A cover. Oh no, this is the C cover. Why is this the C cover? I don't know. I thought this was the A cover, but it looks like the A cover. Oh, I know the A cover is a different artist. Okay, I got you. But so this is the um, the trade dress variant of the first one, which is the Virgin. Uh, I figured it out. So I'm a smart guy. And Moon Knight uh, number three. This is a third printing. I want to say, yeah, it's third third printing, second printing, probably third printing <laughs> of number three. It's been, a, it's been a while getting here as well. And here is the, I want to say the A cover. Yeah, this is the A cover of Batman 118. So this is, uh, 
It's just kind of cool. I like the uh, the Spider-Man homage cover actually better, but uh, this is this is this is cool in its own right. It's got the new new uniform, new costume, I should say. And this is Green Lantern number nine. I think this is um, the first appearance of something I don't remember <laughs> why I picked it up. And it was like it was like less than cover price because I think it's a fine copy, not a near mint copy, which is fine for me because usually they overgrade there at uh, at my comic shop. Uh, Buffy, uh, the last Vampire Slayer, a cover number one. Oh, is he? Uh, ooh, Batman, two eighteen. This is the one. I'm gonna mess it up. I know the one in. I want to say twenty five, at least maybe fifty. The Jock variant. Uh, this one um, you got the reflective cover. It's hard to get it just right, but and this is I think and uh, this is a seven five. So it says here. So I don't see any apparent flaws, but. Maybe that, uh, I don't know, this is, so I got this for like less than uh, going rate. Here it was for, but for like maybe like, maybe 15 bucks, 20 bucks. I don't think I was high when I ordered this book, <laughs> but this is um, the Bad Girls number one. Bad Girls number one, I should say. Uh, I want to say this is the C cover. And it's not a variant cover. I mean, actually, it's, it's a variant cover. It's not an incentive cover. But for some reason, it's like it's nine ninety nine. So I don't I don't know why I ordered this, but maybe I just like the art and um, and I don't know. I don't know. Just one of those things, you know. Late night comic book ordering. This is what happens, folks. All right, this is this is this one I haven't seen at the local comic shops at all. This is the Conan number one facsimile. Uh, I I haven't seen this around. I don't know. If, Y'all were able to pick that up if you were looking for it. And I was, I think I pre-ordered it. So this was like two months ago when I ordered it. So I, was, I got two copies and this is just, man, I love me some facsimiles. I'm a, I'm a variant guy and a facsimile guy. I'm one of those. Speaking of which, variant of Gun Honey number four. Uh, this is, I want to say the, uh, the, the E cover, I want to say, but don't quote me on that. And here is the virgin cover of, of that virgin variant of that same cover. Very nice. Very nice. Coming down to the last couple here is white number five. Second printing. Always pick up my copies of white, as you know, because these are just like 2,500 copies per printing. And the last one is a, a Scout Comics. Uh, joint and i haven't seen this anywhere <laughs> the recount third printing number one um this right now i think it's probably like a 20 dollar book uh, i got i, I pre-ordered this one too I, if i'd known it was going to be such a demand for it, i probably got a couple of this one too so yeah this is yes some good stuff here some good new stuff so thanks for stopping by folks uh enjoy your holiday and i'll see you next week Hey, don't forget to subscribe and leave a thumbs up.